you will have treasured Christ above all above all the accumulation of stuff you will have laid up treasures in heaven and not on earth right that's what you're doing now you're not laying up treasures on earth you are laying up treasures in heaven you are maximizing your enjoyment of the reward you have not only fled fornication and adultery you have fled opulence you have fled ostentation you have fled riches you have remembered the story of the rich young man i have it on a plaque over the door in my study remember the rich young man piper whatever else you forget don't forget him you remembered that as you've served in these decades and will serve you you've heard the apostle paul and you've taken it into your heart and you've blazoned it on the brain in your head those who desire to be rich fall into temptation into a snare into many senseless and hurtful desires that plunge them into destruction and ruin just to want to be rich does that to you and you've heard that and you put it on the inside of your brain and you've led a church another way that's what will make you salty and bright you have eaten the words of Isaiah. All flesh is like grass, and all its glory like the flower of grass. The flower falls and the grass withers, but the word of the Lord abides forever. You've put it inside your heart, and that's where you live. That's what you are thinking. My desire and my prayer for you is that your life and your ministry will have a radical flavor. And I say this for the glory of Christ. The world is not going to glorify Christ because they see that Christians are wealthy and healthy and prosperous very simple reason why that's what they live for so you use Jesus to get it they use other means to get it they're not impressed Jesus is the ticket when the show starts you throw the ticket away. They don't need your ticket. They're not impressed. I'm saying what I'm saying because I want them to be impressed. They're not impressed with us. Prosperous, wealthy, safe middle class do what everybody else does people don't build a church like that don't go there don't spend your life like that it will be wasted you will have lived it